athlete. I come in every day if I train. I don't, I don't like anybody at work with me at all or anything. So like we can be having a coloring contest. I don't want you to beat me. I'm real competitive. So everything I do, I'm going to work my hardest and try to beat you or, or outlift you or beat you in a race. Whatever we do, I'll, I'll, I'm going to work hard at it. I try to make each day better than what it was the previous day. And that's, that's what we go by every day and that's what we do. My parents, they put me in sports when I was in kindergarten, football, basketball, all swimming, all types of stuff, and I ended up falling in love with football and basketball and I just stuck with it. Me and Coach Chan go back to when I was a little kid and he, it was like a, you're welcome here anytime you want to. If you don't play, I'm, I'm, I'm still here for you. If you do play, let's work. It was just like, and I couldn't lead the guys. I've been playing all four years with the same people. So it's like, I'm playing my last year. Overall, he's a great kid. Um, I think he wants the best for everyone. I think that he put others before himself. And with his football mentality like he played here, he just want to put everybody on his back and make sure we can get a win. My dad, me and him share a lot of uh, different things. He played basketball and football. I do the same. We just got the same same hobbies pretty much. Um, he's a junior for a reason. So, I mean, he's dead on his dad. Um, his dad is, is, is big in his life. You know, my mom have a different type of relationship, so it's like, if I want something or need something, I will go straight to her. If my dad's on me, <laughs> had a bad game, I work hard enough, I'm, I'm gonna go to her. But yeah, really got, really all close as a family. Shaka would do anything without the approval of his dad and with his mom too, so I, I just think that both parents have, have, have been very influential in his life. I think it's great, you know, what I've seen and what I've seen, what I've watched as a kid, you know, Shaka, little Shaka is always trying to be like Big Shaka. When my uncle died, that uh, like turned a different switch and it made me uh, grind harder and work for him and uh, be the man I am today. Like, he's a real funny guy, so like, he had seen me and pushed me around and I really couldn't do nothing because he was bigger than me. But I always told him once I got, once I got big, oh, that's gonna stop. <laughs> He played a, a real big role, so like my dad and everybody else I talked to say he was real good at football and he was basically me before me and he always told me if I keep my head on straight and do what I gotta do to get my grades, everything would be everything would be alright and I could make it big one day. So that stuck with me and that's what, that's why I keep doing what I'm doing. I chose Ball State because uh, Coach New, Coach Lynch, I mean they've been on me since my sophomore year. They were one of the first ones to talk to me. They just helped me feel like Ball State was a perfect fit for me, and it's not far from home at all. Every time I come in there, they try to put something to do with football in the basketball, so we condition it, and they say, do everything, be aggressive in there, do everything you do, because everything is going to translate to when I get to Ball State. You get in there, you can maybe earn you a spot, get on the field, do whatever you got to do. He's done all. He's done all. I mean, he, you know, he got out on the court, um, and he's going to play. He's going to give you all what he has um, out there he's in, until he's gassed. You know, and I think that's the football side of him. But in, in basketball, you know, he's trying his best to make sure that, you know, like today we had some sprints to do. And one of the teammates was just half doing it. And he went and got on him and told him, hey, pick this up. You know what, you're making the whole team run because you're not doing what you're supposed to do. Last year, he wouldn't have done it. You gotta go to the next the next game, the next play, the next practice. You gotta go day by day. You can't think about what happened previous day or the last game or the last practice. You gotta go day by day and make that day better than the last one.